Down on the sideline with Fran Fischella, of course, in New York City, everybody knows you for your time with Manhattan and St. John's. Also a broadcaster, but you've been out here doing games this week. What are a couple of things that have stood out to you? Uh, as far as being out here, mm -hmm. it's been fun. You know, what I love about the Summer League is that you obviously have the first round picks, the guys that give teams like the Knicks hope, watch Kevin Knox play, some of these other young stars. But the other thing about the Summer League that's so cool is guys that maybe played in college three or four or five years ago that have been in the G League playing overseas, and they're fighting for jobs too. And uh, so everybody's out here. It's the epicenter of the basketball world in the summer. It's like the NBA's Disney World. And uh, it's great being out here, but most importantly, it's great to see these young guys fighting for their careers because whether they were in high school or college, they come out here, they start all over. You mentioned Kevin Knox. He's certainly impressing this week. What do you like about his game, and how do you see him transitioning into the bigs? Well, I think he's, he's going to translate well because what I like about him is that he's an NBA athlete. He plays hard, which is critical for a young player. And obviously, he's shown some ability to put the ball in the basket, and especially from the perimeter. If you're a young player coming into the league, shooting is a big factor right now. And we've seen Kevin make some outside shots, which just kind of blends in with the athleticism. So as a Knicks fan, even though I haven't been back home and living in New York in quite a while, um, any Knicks fan's got to be excited. And for those of you booing, come on, give him a break. He's playing well. And you know all things European basketball, all the guys coming out of Europe. Talk about some good shooters, talent. Yeah. The Knicks had a big signing this week with uh, Mario Hazonia. Yeah. What do you think about him, and what do you think he brings to this team? Well, he's one of those guys that maybe, like, I've, like I said earlier about these guys fighting for jobs, Mario's run in, in Orlando didn't go the way anybody expected. Certainly, I thought he would have a more major contribution, but... As we see time and time again in, in this league, you got to be in the right place at the right time. And uh, to me, I think he's going to a fresh start. Scott Perry knows him from having drafted him. Uh, David Fisdale is a coach that's going to give him confidence. And Mario's a young enough player that I think there's still a bright future ahead. A lot of it's up to him and how hard he works. But I think this is a really good fit for him, especially since, you know, he's going to have to own what happened in Orlando and prove that he can play in this league. Thank you so much for your time. We appreciate it. Thank you.